as that's grounded to LeMahieu on the backhand off one leg. In time as Ford completes the stretch and VR is out. We got bodies everywhere. LeMahieu on the left side, a couple guys down on the right. You know we're going to have a replay. Let's look at this. I'm going to give him an out call right out of the get go. I think you're on the money there, Paul. Airborne stretch. Foot on the bag, right? Yep. And I think though that's one of those scenarios where if VR runs through the bag instead of diving. He very well may have been safe. Some radio, you know how the yeah. just don't quite get good reception. Gardner lines that to left center field. The long run, Santander can't get there and start the merry-go-round. One run scores. Two run scores. Torres is in. It's a bases clearing triple for Brett Gardner. And the Yankees take a 3 nothing lead. That one skips away. Valera is going for third. He's safe, and that ball's into left field. Valera will score. LeMayu is going to hang on at third. The Yankees increase the lead to 4 0. With a walk off home run, the only is Orioles, the only one they've had this year. And he'll chop that one. Pitcher's got to cover. Manaply gets there, finds the ball from Ford, and gets the out and RBI. Hey guys, I mean, you know, you talk about Alberto, and Yars having a nice year. Mancini, who steps to the plate. That one going deep to right field. At his way back, and goodbye, home run. Trey Mancini had one in the opener, and he gets one here, and he gets two RBIs as well. And the Orioles are right back in it. A four-three ball game on the Mancini 29. And of course, that's what Brandon was talking about. Torres, Didi, Urshela, and Maven all went deep. As Ford trying to go deep in this one. He did. That's into the bullpen. Mike Ford with his fourth home run of the season. It's 5 3 bombers. Well, you got to root for him. You see what he's done in the minor leagues. You just hope that he gets an opportunity here at the major leagues to show that he can hit. And you can just see his swing really not a lot. Is he going to get a double play to start his career? Oh, the bare hand fire from Torres. That was pretty, and the family loves it. You can't have a better start than that if you're Brady Lyle. All riders told him that he was headed to the big leagues. At first, he thought he was in trouble. Torres skies that deep to left center field. That ball is gone. Glaber Torres with a three-run bomb. His 12th of the year against Baltimore. And it's an 8-3 game as Leo gets more support. Wow. Uh, I mean, you knew it off the bat. He knew it off the bat. Lieber Torres likes black and orange. He had Swing and a miss. The first career strikeout for Brady Lale. His family loves it. A 1-2-3-6. Brady Lale's mother, Jody, was... Fired up after this strikeout, the first career strikeout for a son, and after the outburst of elation comes relief. Torres powers that to left field and deep. Going back, Peterson. He has done it again. This is absolutely absurd. Glaber, the Oriole killer. His 13th of the year against Baltimore, and I can only imagine what Gary Thorne is saying. I'm going to go tell Gary Thorne I've had enough, too. <laughs> I am. You get the misplay at second. 1 0 delivery on the way. Whoa. Way back, and goodbye, home run. And the Orioles get three on an Alberto homer to make it an 11 to 6 ball game in the barrage of. RBI's off homers continues here at Yankee Stadium. Well, we know the drill. I mean, you pitch in the middle of the plate with this baseball this year. They and are waiting on deck. One out. And that's going to be a base hit into right field by Ruiz. It'll score Peterson. It'll score Alberto. Two runs in. And the Orioles are still in it. The 1 0. 
Fly ball in the air to left center. Maven is there. Ball game. The Yankees win it 11-8, and they sweep this doubleheader with the Orioles.